Hello, my name is Eric and together with my team Sandra, Jana and Thomas, we completed a project in which we worked on a method of better teaching students logistical principles other than the regular oral explanations. The scenario which has been created has a focus of teaching the planning of a layout for a factory with limited space to work with. Normally, this would be taught only theoretically, but the learning effect is by far better if this knowledge is used right away. So to pass this on to the students and make it as memorable and as fun as possible, we chose the construction and management game Factorio as the teaching medium in which we have developed a scenario to teach exactly these competencies. The scenario will now be explained. As you can see, there is a restricted space for which the students are supposed to plan and build a layout for the red and the green science packages. Around the space, there are walls which premises should not be left. The resources needed will be brought by a train which is doing a milk run to bring the deliveries at set intervals. The red and the green science packages are the final products which should be brought to a chest or science laboratory that is supposed to simulate the warehouse for outgoing goods. The materials needed to build a plant factory are provided at the top of the map in a chest. As you can see there are robotic arms, furnaces, conveyor belts and everything else that is needed to complete this task. The mining camps for the supplied resources have been built in a size big enough so that it is not possible for them to run out in the time that the students use to complete the task. The production of electricity has been provided as well so the students can focus on the given task without worrying about any shortages. As soon as a task has been completed, it can, if wanted, be evaluated by using the blueprint mod, for example, which enables the user to see all the materials used for the whole production. This task it isn't made to be very complex, to give the students the chance to use their recently earned logistical knowledge right away without having to spend too much time to learn the inner workings of the game. Of course it is possible to work on more difficult and complex problems afterwards, but this is only supposed to be an introduction into learning with Factorio. For example, it is possible to build a production which uses as little resources as possible or to produce a fixed amount that has been set at the beginning. It's even possible to use and connect sensors and actuators to build complex programmable logic controllers to do automated inventory controls and only produce goods if needed. The possibilities of Factorio are sheer endless and what's not possible can simply be added by mods. 